In this video, we will look at two ways of growing cells in the lab, batch cultures and continuous cultures. Okay, so batch cultures are what you're most probably most familiar with. In a batch culture, you grow the cells in a flask or on a plate, typically overnight or over several days. That is, you grow the cells in a defined space or volume. In continuous cultures, the cells are continually grown in a vessel that is sometimes called a fermenter, a chemostat, or a bioreactor. In a continuous culture, you have the cells in a fixed volume and you add new media. And because you are adding new media, you get a flow of media, the same volume as flowing in, out of the vessel. And as the media is flowing out, you harvest the cells and purify the product. However, setting up such a continuous culture can be tricky because if you think back to your bacteria growth curve, if your flow of media into the vessel is too slow, then the cells will move into the stationary and then the death phase of the curve as nutrients become exhausted and harmful metabolites build up. If you add media too fast, then the cells will not have sufficient time to divide and you will wash out the vessel. Hence, you need to hit a sweet spot where the flow of media into the vessel means that the cells are continually dividing and making your product. That is, the total cell number in the vessel remains constant. 